let's talk about contracts and implementations. So in software, a contract is like a business contract. It's something that we're going to agree to, but like a contract, there are terms. These come in the form of method names. So on the screen, you'll see that I have a interface defined for a DVR. Note, interface is also known as a contract. And you'll see it has two terms. One is play, the other is pause. Remember, these come in the form of methods. And so let's say we have a provider called Hayden. Well, Hayden implements the contract. It gets an API past the constructor, and then it abides by the contract. And you'll see in its underlying API that they make a reference to their own API that's called play and pause. But let's say I have a, a different provider. This one's called Honeywell. They do the same thing, but as you'll notice, play and pause, the underlying API, they say press play or press pause. Remember, Hayden's was a little different. Well, let's say we now have a controller. But in the controller, I provide the contract to the constructor. It's going to try to resolve it out of the IOC container. But you know what's going to happen when you go to run this? You're going to find out Laravel's going to say it's not instantiable. What this just means is that Laravel doesn't know what you want to do with it. So we have to tell Laravel, we need to give this an implementation. So we're going to start off with binding that contract to the Honeywell implementation. And let's go and view this. So if I wanted to pause the DVR, it would return pause Honeywell DVR. If I wanted to play the Honeywell DVR, it would as well. But let's say we there comes a day and we're like, you know what? I don't want to use Honeywell anymore. I want to use Hayden. So we just swap out which implementation we're going to use. We're going to refresh. Now it says play Hayden DVR and pause Hayden DVR. And that is a clear example of how contracts work. It gives you control over what you do despite which service provides essentially the service in the end. Enjoy. If you found this video useful, I encourage you to leave a like, a comment. Be sure to share. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter at Jordan K. Dalton, or you can follow me on YouTube at DaltonCast. And I'll see you on the next one.